What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading for all signs, caps of Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Free general collective reading. Um, I want to say real quick before we get into it. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 12,105 subscribers. So thanks so much for all the love and support. Love you guys so much. I truly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart chakra. Um, you help support a single mama's one of her income streams. So thanks so much for all the love and support. I appreciate it. Okay, so we're just going to dive right into it. Um, let me get the song because I've been forgetting about that recently. I honestly... This is a crazy one. This is a crazy, crazy, crazy one. I mean, it's somebody's life out there in the energetic space. So and I got it for a reason, so I'm going to put it out. But I just want a disclaimer before I put it out. It's a freaking crazy one. Whoever's doing this, um, they're going to get caught. They are going to get caught, but I'm glad. Just saying, just saying. Um, just for real, for real. Um, that's what causes crazy readings. Just let everybody know. Or people like this. And that's just the truth. Let me get this on. Hopefully we get an equal, quite, equally crazy song to kind of tie in the energy here because, oh my goodness. Okay, okay. So the song playing right now is Remedy by Seether. So, well, I heard they're going to get caught. So I think that's the remedy to this situation. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Remedy by Seether is what's playing right now. If another one plays, I'll let you know. Okay. So the channel message I received was um, someone has recreated. Okay. I just want to say before I deliver it, and you can go back and check my readings, but it was, a, I think it was two or three weeks ago, something like that. You can go back and check them. But I was pulling in someone that recreated, that basically, okay, so they had a business idea, business plan, what have you, to recreate a real world type situation. For anybody who doesn't know, real world is a show that was um, created a when I was a teenager, and I'm 38 years old, um, on TV, uh, on the TV uh, station, music television, MTV, it was called The Real World, but everybody knew the cameras were in there. Of course, they signed a contract with the TV um, show and all that. A bunch of strangers living in a um, space, um, different cities, different episodes, different seasons, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But of course, they all knew the camera was in there. Uh, cameras were in there but it was like a real world type this person recently in the energetic space has created this real world s type um situation in their own family dynamic um but there's some kind was some kind of incest in it from what i was picking up um apparently they've been making money off of it um, they, they did it for money reasons. They did it for money reasons. Whoever this is for, they did it for money reasons. Um, it was clear as day in the reading that they did it for money reasons. And they used their own family to do it. Now, that's basically the reading that was like three, two, three, four weeks ago, whatever it was. Um, I think I titled it, somebody recreated a real world type situation it's about to backfire hashtag incest i think is what i titled it but you can go back and check it if you're interested or if you know somebody that's done this but anyways i think this might piggyback off that reading is what i'm trying to say um possibly you plug it in how it resonates but it's it's crazy i just want to say it's crazy you go to that great of links to make you some money and you're using your own family as collateral to do it that it's it's sick now it's not like secret seven i just want to make that clear it's not like the secret seven i was originally pulling in because that was a single mother and somebody was trying to set her up and being malicious by basically 
recording her every move, but they were making huge bank off of it, recording her and her children's every move. The whole community was in on it, basically. They loved spying on her, but nobody in her community ever told her the damn camera was in there. But it started creating huge problems in her personal life. She got uh, wrongfully terminated three times in a year. I mean, it created a huge hot mess. So it's not like the Secret Seven because that single mother never intentionally, she didn't do it. She didn't plant the hidden camera in her home. Somebody else did for strategic, malicious intent and purposes. But that Secret Seven situation stemmed a ton of other Secret Seven S type situations because there was so much popularity behind the scenes there that other criminals started implanting other cameras in other parts of the world and country and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So much so that when I went full time with this in the summer of 2021, there was about a, a thousand of you guys that found hidden cameras in your homes, in your vehicles in your personal spaces, personal dwellings, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, it was that crazy. Um, and I'm glad we helped combat some of it. But it also created people trying to look just like single mom Leo because they wanted to be the star. They wanted to be the star. She technically was a star behind the scenes. She never wanted to be a star. Um, and she never made any money off of it. But um, because those people were so damn greedy and malicious. Uh, but it created like mental, I think some of those people already had mental health issues, but I think it exacerbated it to the point they were getting like surgeries to look like her and dressing just like her and like re trying to recreate their whole life to look, be just like her. Like it was that weird, but it wasn't like a true reality TV show, like keeping up with the Kardashians or something like that, because she never made a dime off of it. It was strictly criminal. It was strictly criminal. So I wonder what I, where I'm going with that is I wonder if this is stemming off of that is what I'm trying to say. I, I truly think it might. And I'm just being for real, for real. But you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so the channel message I received was um, someone... Um, a feminine energy, I heard a feminine energy, um, has drug her family into um, a huge hot mess express to just strictly to make money. Um, there's there's already been huge towers. Um, I heard cameras, cameras. So I'm presuming it's the same situation with that person that um, planted all these cameras in their home for um, their real world type S business idea, um, but they're using their family as collateral to do it, basically. I'm presuming, but you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard cameras, so I mean, there's cameras all in this home or this space or these vehicles or what have you, uh, but it's a feminine energy that did it um, in this family in some shape, form, or fashion. Uh, but I heard there's already been huge towers, I'm assuming negative towers, and there's about to be more. Um, I heard the feds are about to shut this down in a huge way. Um, there was, there's already been an investigation going previous, but there's about to be tons of streams of information flow to the, uh, federal agents regarding this situation and a serious situation of the past. I heard secret seven. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Uh, so that's another reason why I think, um, secret seven is, um, that whoever did this for this one, this is a newer one in the energetic space. But I think they were a part of the Secret 7 hidden camera energy of the past. And they wanted to make money and be just like single mom Leo and her kids. They wanted the fame and fortune, etc., etc., for themselves. So they tried to be like single mom Leo and her kids. But the thing is, single mom Leo never even wanted that shit. She never even agreed or consented to it. She never wanted it. And now it's about to backfire on this feminine energy. Whoever this feminine energy is that did this to her family, basically. Um, I wonder if she was a core member of the Secret Seven previously, but she wanted all the greed and fame and fortune for herself. So she decided to go out on a limb and do it herself. I don't know. Um, only this person knows their story, not anybody else. But it's definitely feminine energy. I heard there's already been communication, communication flow to federal agents about this one. So it's not the Secret Seven, original Secret Seven, because we all know that's been shut down now. But 
I wonder if it's a core member of the original Secret Seven um, to try to make bait, trying to um, try to be the star, you know, whatever, trying to make the big G's. I don't know. I didn't hear it was. But I did hear there um, has already been huge communication flow to federal agents regarding this one. So this newer one. Um, and more is about to come to federal agents. Um, I heard the federal agents are about to shut it down. They're about to shut it down. So you plug it in how it resonates. And I, I mean, something is going on in this home or homes or situation where it needs to be shut down. I wonder if it's incest because the last reading I picked up regarding something like this, it was, there was some kind of incestual situation going on where it was about to make the business tank down um, for the people viewing through the camera, not federal agents shutting it down, but something is about to happen where federal agents are about to shut the shit down. They are about to shut it down. So you plug it in however it resonates. Um, however that applies. Let me see if I hear anything else. Someone's accounts are about to be frozen too. They are about to be pissed. Fraud and theft. There will be huge charges here. Fraud and theft. True colors have truly been seen. Oh my God, you plug it in. How resonates. This is so woo. Okay, I heard accounts are going to be frozen too. So it's a fem energy that did this. Um, it was her grand master plan to basically exploit her own family. So it wasn't like Secret Seven because that whole family was exploited, including including the adult. Um, and that's why Leo tried to get help, but her community just will not help her because they just wanted to. I think they wanted energy harvest off of her, steal her ideas, um, and etc. 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 They were just they were greedy, basically. When they could have been done the right thing and been heroes and helped, they harm. They just harm, period. But this person free willingly did it to her family. She free willingly did it. Oh my God, let's make some money. I want to be rich. But it sounds it sounds like she is an intent she's intentionally free willingly causing harm to her own family, unlike the Secret Seven situation where the poor mother was trying to save her family from harm. This woman, just chickadoos, like, sure, yeah, use my, sure, why not? Just saying, I mean, I'm, I'm serious. Um, there's something not right in the cognitive spaces there, and I'm just being serious. But anyway, so, um. I heard it's going to be shut down. Accounts are going to be frozen. Some kind of accounts. It could be her account. Somebody else's accounts are connected to her. But somebody's accounts are about to be frozen in this situation. I think it's the feminine energy. It may be people connected to the feminine energy as well, possibly. Um, and um, uh, I heard some kind of very large fine, too. Um, so I'm assuming she's going to have to pay a very large fine in some shape, form, or fashion. And there's some, uh, there's some kind of th uh, fraud and theft, too, going on there, too. So, I strongly feel, and I didn't hear any of this, but I strongly feel it is so, uh, was a core member of the Secret Seven that did this to her own family. And I'm serious about that. I do. Um, she wanted to be a boss bitch. She wanted to be the star. She wanted to make the big G's. And she used her family as collateral to do it. Is what, I, what I'm feeling. I didn't hear that. That's just my deductive logic, reasoning, and intuition. But I want to say the Secret Seven situation should have never happened. It should have never happened. I was saying it on here when I was doing the Secret Seven readings. And it's still the truth. It should have never happened. And that's the truth. And the Secret Seven situation caused more harm than good to everybody involved. Because nobody did the right thing to step up to help that poor family. They just wanted to use and abuse their asses. 
which they did use and abuse them. They were successful in that. But did it benefit the community or benefit the world or benefit the family? No. It just did nothing but destroy, harm, and hurt. So really, did did the viewers of the camera, the Secret Seven of the past, did it really help you any? I'm just asking the burning questions here. Did it really help you any by not doing the right thing? I just, I, I'm asking the burning questions here. Just saying, just saying. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. All right, someone's getting a huge wake-up call. I'm serious. Spirit messages you have reflected. Courtship, false person, reverse, poverty, upright. Prison will definitely be a part of this feminine energy's life. Very, very much sooner than she thought. An air sign is getting a huge, huge, huge wake up call. Huge. Oh my Lord. Wow. Okay. I heard a prison will definitely be a part of this feminine energy's life a lot sooner than she thought, than she uh, seemed to think. I think she thought she would get away with this. Um, and I want to say too, before we die, um, continue into this, Vision Goddess Tarot did a reading recently. I actually promoted it on my channel, so it's very easy for you guys, my subscribers, to access. Um, it's the last reading of hers that I promoted on here. It's called um, Copyright Going Wrong or something like that. I wonder if that one is part of this, possibly. I didn't, I, I didn't hear it was, but... I wonder if she got her stuff copyrighted and she maybe she used the Secret Seven as copywriting material, which you can't do that. I'm not saying she did. I'm not saying she did, but I wonder if it's piggybacking off of it because you can't use Secret Seven terror, terror readings as copywriting. Um, because I have the Secret Seven um, material copyrighted under tarot card readings. Um, I do. And I fought hard for that crap. Hard, hard, hard for it. Um, but, and I'm serious about that. So, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Because I don't know she. I don't know if she's a reader. I didn't hear she was a reader. Um, I wonder if she's trying to re recreate like she's the victim. Um, I think she's trying to, I think she implanted the camera in her home. But I think she's trying to recreate like she's a uh, single mom Leo. And I didn't hear any of this. This is just a deductive logic reason. I think she re she put cameras in her own home. She set up the accounts to go to her so she'd get paid for whoever views in. Unlike Secret 7 where Single Mom Leo never got paid a dime because the accounts went to somebody else. But she set up the own cameras in her own home, set up the banking information to her own account so she would get paid. But she plays the role in her home and life in this reality TV show as like a single mom Leo S type energy. Like she doesn't know the cameras are in there. Like she's a victim. But all behind the scenes, when she opens up her banking app, she's get, making bank off of it. She is really the one getting paid for it. Unlike Secret 7 where single mom Leo never got paid a dime because it was the Secret 7 slash 10 that basically made all the money off of it. And refuse to tell single mom Leo. That's what I'm thinking. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Like she goes and recreates herself in this home or role or wherever the cameras are. Because she knows where the cameras are. Because she, hell, she put them there. Or help put them there. And she she might, I think she might be a reader. I didn't hear she was, but I think she might be a reader. She wanted her numbers to go up. She wanted popularity to go up. She wanted, um... She might be a doppelganger to single mom Leo too, possibly. I didn't hear she was, but she might be. And she wanted her popularity, her fame to go up. So she knew it worked for single mom Leo, even though it didn't technically benefit single mom Leo because it was a bunch of criminals and crooks that made money off her. Um, but she wanted to be like her so bad that she basically acts like she's single mom Leo, like a victim. 
But she's really not a victim because when she opens up her banking app, she's making all the money off of it. So she's basically duping her viewers. I mean, and that's just the truth. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call, huge-ass wake-up call. Okay, I heard someone's getting a wake-up call, huge-ass wake-up call. I'm serious. I, we already have air sign getting a wake-up call in here. It might be somebody else getting a wake-up call. I'm serious. Somebody's taking reality TV shows to a new freaking heights, man, but in the criminal sector. And I'm just being serious. I'm being freaking serious. I heard prison's coming a lot sooner than she seems to think. And honestly, it should. She needs to be orange in the orange. And I'm not talking about the TV show Orange is the New Black. I'm talking about orange behind bars. Number 8437 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 8437. It could be possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible day birth number. Possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible jersey number, 8437. False person reversed. This feminine energy is very, very, very aggressive. There's about to be a lot of aggressive behavior inside her home and in public. She might get arrested in public before the feds come officially. Business is not going near the way it used to. Whoa, so you plug in how it resonates. Holy crap. Okay, so I heard, um, okay, so the business isn't going near as well as it used to. So it sounds like business used to be booming for this person, this femme energy, um, that basically uses her family as chess pieces and pawns and collateral for her money-making business, dirty business ideas. Um, I didn't hear what sign she was. So you have to plug this person in, whoever she is and how she resonates in your life. You might be a viewer through this show. And it's not, elite, it's not illegal because she, I mean, hell, she, you think it might be, you think it might be, possibly, um, but it's not because really she, when she opens up her banking statements, she gets the money, but I heard the business has tanked in a huge way, so I think you guys have gotten a wake-up call that it was a scam is what I'm thinking in all seriousness. I think you've already gotten a wake-up call. A lot of you guys have already gotten a wake-up call that it was a scam and you quit, quit watching. But it sounds like she still has some watchers. Um, but overall, the business has already plummeted. And so I heard she's, there's about to be some, she's very aggressive person is what I heard. So she's very aggressive. So she exerts a lot of fire sign energy. Um, I don't care what sign she is. She exerts a lot of fire sign energy, but she sounds like she does it on the dark side. I'm a fire sign. We all know that. I'm Leo's son. Um, with my, which Leo is a fire sign placement. I have a one fire sign placement in my charts. But I don't care if you have a fire sign placement or fire sign placements or no fire sign placements in your charts. You can always exert fire sign energy. It's how you grow and manifest yourself. I wonder if she has some kind of mental health issues. I mean, if they're not diagnosed, they're undiagnosed. And I'm serious. Anybody that would do that to their family. And I'm feeling children in here under like minor energy. I didn't hear there was, but I'm strongly feeling minor energy. You have mental health issues. I don't care if they've been diagnosed or undiagnosed. Uh, I don't care if they've been diagnosed or undiagnosed. You have mental health issues. If you would do that to your family, especially if you have minors. And that's the truth. I'll offer some money. I'll offer some green sacks. I'll offer some moolah. You have mental health issues. Whether you want to admit you do or not, you do. And that's just the truth. I'm not saying you guys, but I'm just talking about this fem energy in general. I'm serious about that. Um, she seems like a very attention-seeking, clout-seeking, drama starter kind of person. Like money-hungry, materialistic person. Just for real. So I'm thinking the false person reversed is her aggressiveness about to come out on this on this camera. Whether she wants, I mean, something's going to happen. I think the viewers that still do watch, it sounds like a lot of viewers have strayed away already. 
and it's made her her money go down, which has pissed her off. But something I think is going to precipitate in this home situation that's going to bring out the aggression, intensify the in aggression. But it's not only going to be in this home situation where the cameras are, it's going to be out in public too. I heard she might end up getting arrested by local police, it sounds like, by something that's about to happen out in public before the feds get to her. So it sounds like the feds are, they're already on to her ass. They're already on to her. And there's already been reports into the feds regarding this situation. More are about to come in, which is going to, I think, uh, precipitate the feds to come sooner. The feds, it sounds like they're going to get involved in this. It sounds like they are going to. So much so they're about to shut the accounts down and do this huge investigation and prison. I mean, it's it hasn't happened yet, but it sounds like it's coming. She's about to get aggressive because she's not making the money she thought she was going to make. She might get arrested in public for some kind of aggressive behavior um, before the feds get to her. So her true self is about is already started coming out or is about to come out. How that resonates. False person reverse. And to me, this false person reverse too could be the reports that are, have already been to, been into federal agents regarding this. She, um, she, I mean, I don't hate to say it. I'm sorry, not sorry when I say this. Shit show of a crazy ass reality TV show scam, basically. And I'm serious about that. I mean, I'm sorry, not sorry. This is a hot mess. I mean, if I feel she's got minor energy in here. Her poor kids are probably going to need therapy. And probably a lot of it. Having to be um, succumbed to this craziness. And I'm serious about this. I'm serious as a heart attack. So I think this is dual energy. I think this is her aggressive behavior intensifying. Possibly viewers on the camera are about to see this intensification of her aggressive behavior and people out in her own community in public. So much so she might get arrested in public for some kind of intense aggressive behavior before the feds get here. So that's, this to me is the feminine energy's aggressive behavior intensifying in some shape, form, or fashion, either around the cameras or in public or both possibly. And dual energy of the reports that have already come into federal agents regarding this crazy hot mess express and more about to come in. Um, so false person reversed report energy and her aggressive behavior. Oh, courtship upright. She's about to lose it all. She thought she was so smart. Oh my God, I heard she's about to lose it all. She thought she was so smart, is what I heard. She thought she's about to lose it all. She thought she was so smart. So you plug it in how it resonates. I mean, maybe you're the feds watching, possibly, or somebody that has already reported to the feds, or you're about to report to the feds on this, if you know about this situation. Or maybe you watch through the camera. I mean, I'm not sure, only you know your story, not anybody else, but this is pretty cray cray. Courtship. This feminine energy has had many, 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 many lovers in the community. Many. Cancer is about to become very significant in this feminine energy's life, too. It is about to shock the hell out of her. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Dear God. Okay, so... In this instance, I heard she's had many lovers. Paid and unpaid. Definite prostitute energy. Oh, this is getting worse. Paid and unpaid, definite prostitute energy. So she has prostituted herself around her community. But it sounds like the people that, have pro that she's prostituted herself to are protecting her in her community because they want that nookie. They, they want the... The yum yum, they want the walk. 
So they're not going to out her as being a prostitute because they out her as being a prostitute. Their WAP is sitting up in jail. Um, so it doesn't benefit them. Um, so they're protecting a prostitute in their own community, one that exploits their own family um, and is a criminal. Yeah, that's smart, not. Uh, but I heard paid, unpaid, paid and unpaid. So she has gotten around sexually in her community in a huge way. This isn't like single vibe energy where, um, and she might be single or she might be married or she might be dating. I don't know. I didn't hear that part, but it isn't like true single vibe energy is what I'm saying. Like I'm true single vibe energy, like me. And I have been a long time. If you're single, like legally single, you can go around and date whoever you want to date. That's, I mean, I'm serious. And it's one of the reasons why it precipitated me to get divorced because one, I was miserable so miserable in my marriage and two um i wanted to have the freedom to date whoever i wanted to date to see if they'd be a good partner for me down the line hopefully i could find my twin if i didn't find my twin maybe i could find somebody that complimented me very um complimented me in a positive way to where we would be a good like power couple down the line but I would have the freedom to date whoever the hell I wanted to date. If I want to have sex with them, I could have sex with them. If I didn't want to have sex with them, we could go out on five, six dates, and then we could break it off. But have the freedom to do that is what I'm trying to say. That's like true single vibe energy, having the freedom to do that. This is different. This is like prostitution energy. I mean, I'm, I mean I've mean, i been single a long ass time, yes, but have I ever been paid for sexual services? No. Would I ever agree to that? Hell no. It's just... Yikes, it's not within my moral ethics, values, and integrity to be paid for sex. You should never be paid for sex. And that's just the truth. <laughs> you want to have sex with somebody, free willingly have it with them, but don't charge freaking $2,000 for your wife. And somebody might get pissed at to say that, but it's the damn truth. It's the truth. That's the way I look at it. But this person has a long history of prostituting in her community, but it sounds like to a lot of customers. And I think these customers, um, one, they're protecting her. And two, I think they might be high up people. There's a reason they're protecting her. They they don't want their WAP in jail. Um, and some of them, they might have to pay good money for the WAP. Um, but, I mean, she, it's not like she has two or three customers. She's got a whole community full of them. But some of them have paid for it and some have not. But she definitely gets around in the dating and prostitution department. i tell you that. Wow. Poverty upright. One of the customers is about to out her in a huge way. Oh my God. I heard one of the customers is about to out her in a huge way. And someone, a baby father. Okay, so one of the customers is about to out her in a huge way. So that's this. About to be real. They're about to out her. False person reverse. They're about to out her. And this situation is a prostitution customer um, about to out her. So the prostitution, somebody that's had sex with her and actually paid money to have sex with her is about to out her. So, you know, a customer of the prostitution services, basically. That's what this is in this situation about to out her. Now, I don't know if they're going to out her to local police, to feds, or to both. I'm not sure, but one of her customers, it sounds like that was protecting her in the past, is about to out her. Um, and someone, a baby father, I heard. A baby father, too. So, uh, baby father, so I'm just presuming she's not with this masculine energy. Um currently in the universe um i didn't hear spouse i didn't hear um committed partner uh you know sometimes i do i heard baby da baby dad so baby father so she might have dated him in the past she might have been married to him in the past they might have been together together in the past but it doesn't sound like they are now because of her baby father so a customer probably a long-standing sexual customer of hers is about to out her and a baby father I don't know if it's to police, feds, or both. But it sounds like in this situation, this is a smart thing to do because the feds are already on their ass anyways. On her ass. And I'm serious about that. Woo. Poverty upright.
This is about to go very, 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 very public. Very. It will be a very public thing plastered all over, all over media when it's all said and done. She will wish she had never got a part, was a part of this ever. Other people are going to go down as well. Oh my Lord. Wow. This is about to turn into a huge ass thing. And I'm just being for real. This is about to turn into a huge ass thing. It hasn't yet, but it sounds like it's going to. Um, I heard it. She's basically going to be plastered all over the news. Uh, all over the media. I didn't hear news. I heard media, but it's going to go very, very public all over the media. I'm thinking either news media, social media, or both, but it sounds like it might be both in this situation. I heard when it's all said and done. So, Maybe when she's convicted of crime or crimes and she actually, um, or maybe during the trial. I mean, I don't know. Everybody's trial situation is different. Some are public, some are not. So it might be during the trial process. It might be after the trial process. Um, but somehow it's going to go very, very public in media aspects, whether it's social media, news media, or both. I heard she's going to uh, wish she never got involved in this. Um, well, I'm sure she will, but... She wanted the clout. She wanted the fame. She wanted the money. She's about to get the clout and the fame, but not in the way she um, thought she was going to get it. And that's just for Dag, I'm sure. Um, I mean, maybe she'll be a, the big bitch up in prison. But, I mean, I, I hope nobody drops the damn soap. And I'm not, I mean, that goes for females, too. I'm just being for real. For real. I used to work in a jail. I don't care if you're masculine or feminine. People don't fucking play around. And that's just the truth. Jail life, I mean, I've never worked in a prison, but God, I would never want to because they can get buck up in jail. Prison is intensified. At least I've heard it is. I've never worked in a prison. I never want to, but it's because I've worked in a jail and I know what can happen in a jail. Hell, <laughs> imagine, it's, I'm assuming prison is probably like jail times like 500 or 5,000. I wouldn't want to drop the soap anywhere, but especially not in fucking prison. That's just, I don't care. I'm a chicken dude. I don't care. Nay, nay. You come after my goodies, we get in a damn fight. And I'm going down there, I'm trying. I probably will lose, but I will try. And that's just the truth. You can get my damn goodies. That's the truth. But I'm, I'm sorry. I said grass, but I'm serious. <coughs> Excuse me. But yeah, so she wanted clout. She wanted fame. She wanted to make do bukus of money. I think she was a feeder through the Secret 7 camera in the past. If not a core member of the Secret 7 slash 10. I'm serious about that. So she saw all the money that could be made. She wanted it for herself. But she, but she used her family to do it this time. Because she can't, can't use single mom Leo or that situation in the past. If she was a feeder through the Secret 7 camera in the past. Um, I did hear Secret 7 in here. So I think she was connected to Secret 7 in the past. Whether she was a core member of the Secret 7 slash 10. Or she was just a feeder through the camera. But she wanted to make money. Like she saw all those criminals in the past make the money off single mom Leo and her family. But it's about to energetically boomerang back on her basically. Poverty. Uh, that's what I'm feeling. Uh, uh, yes. Oh, my God. And then we have journey reverse and sudden wealth reverse. Expectation upright. Mature woman reverse. You cannot make this up, even if you wanted to. Look at this crap, you guys. This is where her financial status is now or is about to be. I mean, because with legal fees and lawyers and trial and prison and all that shit, I'm sure. I mean, I heard she's not making the money off this business idea near the way she used to. So the business is already down. Feds are about to freaking shut it down anyways. So poverty. Business idea next. Just saying. Journey reversed. Stuck in trial. Stuck in jail possibly. Then prison. Definite stuck in prison. Will be stuck. Stuck, stuck, stuck like Chuck. I think this is financially. I think this is jail. 
I think this is prison. I think this is trial. I think this is embarrassment all over the damn news um, or media or both. I heard media. Sudden wealth reversed. She thought she was going to get sudden wealth upright. Nope. Sudden wealth reversed. Expected sudden wealth upright. But that's not the way the cookie has been crumbling. And it's definitely not the way it's about to crumble. Because this shit is about to blow up in her face in a huge ass way. Just for real, for real. That was her expectation. Mature woman, immature feminine energy. I heard fem energy. She's not a mature, whoever this is, is not a mature feminine energy. Not at all. I mean, so much so, she has a history of aggression and it's about to be amplified. It sounds like impersonal and professional. So much so, I heard she might get arrested out in um, the th 3D, like 3D public soon. All her actions that have been displayed here from what in this 41 minute and 19 second reading so far have been immature. Every single one of them. So definitely immature feminine energy. And I heard feminine energy in here. So definitely immature feminine energy. I mean, all over the place in here. Period. Period. Point blank. Somebody's tired of this shit. Somebody's tired of it. Um, apparently a client a sexual client of hers, and a baby daddy. Um, now, whether she was with the baby daddy previously, like in a committed relationship or not, I'm not sure. Only you know your story, baby daddy, not anybody else if you watch this. Um, but I did, I heard baby daddy, so I have to say baby daddy, just saying. I'm not trying to discount, you know, you might have been in a relationship with her, you might not have been, but I did hear baby daddy, so I have to say baby daddy, okay? I'm not trying to discount you. You might have been a boyfriend, you might have been a um, fiance, you might have been a spouse, but I did hear baby daddy. I think that's current energetic space. You plug it in, hot resonates. But somebody, I mean, at least two people in the universe is tired of this shit, but the feds are already onto this, onto this. You might be the feds already onto this, but it sounds like there's about to be more, more reports into the feds about this. I mean, this is, they, whoever did this, this fem, immature feminine energy that did this, thought she was going to blow it up money-wise. I'm telling you, she thought she was going to blow it up money-wise. But she, in reality, it has not panned out for her the way she thought it was going to. But I think she saw this, she was part of the Secret Seven. And she saw, she thought she was going to be just like those criminals. But she, and she is just like those criminals. Except she ain't no damn smooth criminal. She's about to be plastered all over the freaking, I feel, maybe the world, if not her country, for being a criminal. And I'm serious. I heard she tried to, she's been playing victim, victim to her audience. Um, through, I think through the cameras. She, I think she was trying to recreate Single Mom Leo, is what I think. But the difference between the Secret Seven and this situation, Secret Seven was real. It was real. It really was a true criminal thing where this poor woman was trying to get the damn camera out of her home. She was trying to protect her kids. It really was real. But people just fed into that and thought it was so hee-haw and funny that they didn't want to help her. And all the while, they were accessories to crimes. So she thought she was going to be the victim. But, but it wasn't really victim. It was victim mentality because she wanted the money like she saw those criminals make off the Secret Seven. Wow. Let me see if I hear anything else. Several shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this soon. A foreclosure is very significant in this. And someone's property is about to be seized. Not city level, federal level. Oh my lord, you Good God, this is, this is, this is about to turn into a huge thing. And I'm just being serious. It is about to turn into a huge thing. 
Um, so a foreclosure is significant in here. So it might be maybe she's under foreclosure or someone she's connected to is under foreclosure. Maybe this long standing prostituted client that wanted her WAP and got her WAP but had to pay money for it for so long is maybe their property's under foreclosure. Maybe the baby dad's property's under foreclosure. Maybe somebody else's property's under foreclosure. Maybe hers is. Somebody's property, well, it's either under foreclosure now it's about to be. I heard a foreclosure is significant. So I feel something is either under foreclosure right now, whether it's hers or somebody she's connected to, or it's about to be. Um, and I heard somebody's property is about to be seized, but not city level, federal level. So you, I mean, this is the big boys, big girls, the big boys about to come in and this shit. I mean, I'm serious. They are, I don't know if it's the CIA, the DEA, the FBI, the um, marshals. I'm not sure, but Fed level, whoever the, whatever federal agency this is, um, it, I, I don't know. I didn't hear specifically, but some Fed level, I'm feeling DEA, FBI, CIA, um, or marshals or something of that nature. I mean, property seizure, not city level, I heard specifically, Fed level. Feds are about to take some shit. I'm thinking RICO crime energy. I didn't hear RICO crime in here, but I'm strongly feeling some kind of RICO, RICO crime. And Secret 7 situation was RICO crime energy all day long. It just for real, for real was. It was. It just was. I mean, that's the way I see it. Because it was. Um... I'm serious. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. So some kind of foreclosure is significant in here, whether it's her foreclosure foreclosure for something on her or somebody she's connected to. Somebody's property is about to be seized in this, whether it's Fed level, not city level, that's specific in here, whether it's hers or somebody she's connected to. And um you plug it in how it resonates, man. Holy crap. This person will be convicted many more years than they thought they would be too. And they are about to throw a lot of people under the bus very soon, including one very dirty police officer. Oh my, this is so, man, I wasn't meaning to go more 48 minutes, but this is where we're at. Okay, so, holy crap. So, Okay, so I heard she will be convicted a lot longer than she thought she would be. So conviction, prison, prison sentence is what I'm feeling. Convicted with a prison sentence. I heard, um, of course, none of this has happened yet, but um, you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard she will be convicted a lot long, for a lot longer time than she thought she would, basically. So it sounds like, of course, none of this has happened yet. I held the feds, I didn't got to her yet. But it sounds like when it's all said and done and when the prison, prison sentence gets, um, you know, served to her, um, it sounds like she's expecting it to be, you know, light or minimal. But it sounds like it's going to be a, for a lot longer time than she thought it would be for, basically, is what I'm taking from that. Um, oh, my God. And... Um, uh, I heard she's going to throw a lot more people under the bus than, um, um, than I think these people expected her to. So she is connected to something, whether it's secret. Well, I, I think she's connected to Secret 7 because I heard Secret 7 in here earlier. So I think she knows some core members of Secret 7 or some feeders of the camera, previous Secret 7. Um, and I'm serious about that. Um, I heard these people are going to be shocked, but she is about to quack like a duck. Uh, once the feds get a hold of her, like real fed energy, but they haven't got a hold of her yet. It sounds like um, it's upcoming in the universe. You guys, you might be the feds, or for some of you guys, about to get a hold of her ass, possibly. I'm not sure, only you know your story, not anybody else. But I heard she's going to quack like a duck. So, I mean, I think she's going to quack like a duck to get a lower sentence. 
is what I'm thinking. I didn't hear any of that. That's just my dedu deductive logical reason. Reasoning, I think she's going to quack like a duck, hoping she will get like a plea deal S type energy or get a lower sentence or something. Um, but it doesn't sound like that's going to happen. But it is going to help y'all feds. Um, plus, I mean, maybe if you were the feds watching, we have 12,100 subscribers on here. So it could be feds watching. It could be the baby daddy watching. It could be crazy chickadoo watching. It could be people connected to crazy do chickadoo that she's about to throw under the bus watching. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, there's a lot of you guys on the channel. So you really have to plug yourself in however you resonate if you do. Okay. Um, however that applies in your life. Let me see if I hear anything else. Woo, Lord. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I'm sorry. Um, so she's going to throw all these people under the bus, I guess, when she gets questions by the feds. Because the, the feds have not showed up to her yet. They haven't showed up yet. But it sounds like it's upcoming in the universe um, for her. Um, but I heard she's going to throw many people under the bus. So she's going to quack like a duck and basically throw all these people under the bus. I think to lessen, hopefully lessen her sentence is what, I, what I'm thinking here. But one very particular police officer, dirty cop, I heard she's going to throw under the bus too. Um, and it's going to create many, 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 many negative series of chain of events for him. His life is about to fall apart. Oh, my God. So it's a masculine police officer. I'll tell you that. Um, I heard him. Um, so it's a masculine, dirty cop, whoever this chickadoo is. Um, that it's, a, it's a dirty cop. It's a dirty masculine cop. Um, and I heard, um, she, it sounds like she's going to throw him under the bus to the feds. Um, but I heard once she does throw him under the bus to the feds, so you might be the feds she's about to throw him under the bus to, possibly. Or you might be the dirty masculine cop, for all I know. You plug it in how it resonates. But however it resonates, I heard once she throws him under the bus to the feds, um, a ton of mini series of chain of events are going to occur negatively for him. So whatever those are, I didn't hear specifically what they are. Only these people know their story, not anybody else. You plug it in how it resonates. But a lot of realness is about to be had, I tell you that. Whoever you, whether you're about to make the report, Reports have been made to the feds on this. More about to be made. Secret 7 S type. I think information on Secret 7 has been made to the feds or it's about to be too. Secret 7 tied in this too. This reality hotness express show that this person free willingly did is somehow connected to the Secret 7. So I don't know if some of these reports to the feds are about the Secret 7 of the past too, possibly. But a lot of realness is about to be had. Period. So a lot of realness has already been had. More about to be had. Um, heavy fed energy in here. Dirty cop energy. Prostituting. Um, somebody is um, a customer. Prostitute customer is about to throw this person under the bus. Baby daddy is. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. No more throwing rocks and hiding hands. It's about to come to the light soon. A lot sooner than you think. Oh, shit. Whoa, I heard no more throwing rocks and hiding hands. It's about to come to the light more, a uh, lot more sooner than you think. So I'm assuming that message probably goes to the immature chickadoo. I think she was throwing rocks and hiding hands. For anybody who doesn't know, throwing rocks and hiding hands uh, is basically... Doing nasty, shysty, low vibrational activity behind the scenes to person, people, place, family, or situation. You don't want people to know you're, you don't want certain people to know you're doing it, but you really are doing it. Create negative series of chain of events for people behind the scenes. That's throwing rocks and hiding hands. And, but yet, you don't want to take responsibility for it. That's basically throwing rocks and hiding hands. I think it was her that was throwing rocks and hiding hands. Maybe at the Secret 7 family, because somehow the Secret 7 is connected to her. So, and I'm serious about that. So, I think she was doing this in the past to the Secret 7 family. 
knowing they were going through struggling. They were struggling, 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 but it, yet she was like, it was like kicking them when they were down. And I'm serious about that. All behind the scenes. Um, I heard no more throwing rocks and hiding hands. It sounds like it's the past is about to catch up for her in a huge way. And somehow she's connected to a dirty cop. So she's connected to a lot of low vibrational people. I just want to say that. A lot of low vibrational people. She's connect I mean, she's got a whole community. She's either dated them, just effed them, or she has had them pay for her walk. So much so they have protected her. But it sounds like this community is there's about to be nothing this community can do because it's about to get outside their community to the feds. It sounds like it already has, and more information is about to. Maybe you're the one about to provide the information to the feds, possibly upcoming. Possibly. All right, you guys, we're done. I love you guys so much. Everybody made wonderful choices, and namaste.